So I watched the FP the other day. Um, it's a movie kind of post-apocalyptic, but not quite. Uh, the scenario is similar to a post-apocalyptic uh, setting, you know. Somebody's ruling. Obviously, they have to have somebody ruling more than everybody else. And in this situation, a man by the name of L.E. is ruling over a district called the Fraser Park. Um, and he, he's got control of all the liquor because his dad ran the liquor store or some shit like that. Um, <coughs> and the way that people settle arguments and fights is through Beat Beat Revelation, which is just a ripoff of Dance Dance Revolution. Um, the only reason they didn't actually use DDR is because they didn't have the rights to it. They didn't have the money for it. Uh, so this movie is about um, this guy Beatro. Uh, he lost his he lost his best friend in a match of BB Revelation against L W. Uh, so he's trying to get revenge and take back over Fraser Park. Uh, this movie seems like it was made by. A bunch of people who spent way too much time on the internet. Um, the acting was awful. Uh, the humor was pretty hilarious. Um, it really, uh, I really enjoyed a lot of the humor and the movie in general uh, more than a normal person would because I've been playing DDR for 10 years. So uh, if you're a fan of DDR, you should check it out. It's hilarious. Um, uh, I'm gonna post a link along with this video to the first 11 minutes of the movie and that'll ultimately be the best way to determine if you want to see it or not. If you don't even chuckle at the first 11 minutes you're probably not gonna like the movie but there is one scene that you should watch and if I can find it I'll post it, but I don't know if I'll be able to find it or not. Um, the music was pretty obviously heavily inspired by DDR, so that was interesting. Uh, it took everything from the generic techno of DDR to the generic pop of DDR. Um, the main character, uh, he He's also the writer and director, I think. But he's actually an avid Dance Dance Revolution player. So that that shows at some points, but at other points, <coughs> you just think, have these people ever even played the game? So, <coughs> I think it's hilarious. Um, my friend who watched it with me found it less hilarious. Um, but she also doesn't play the game. So... That leads me to believe that if you like Dance Dance Revolution, you should check out this movie. Definitely watch it with a group of friends. It's not a quality movie by any means, but it's one of those bad movies that you're bound to enjoy regardless. Just in its awfulness. So, I'll post the link to the first 11 minutes, and if I can find the clip, I'll post that as well. But... All in all, it's definitely a pretty amusing movie, to me at least.